I want to tell you a story about planting a seed to change. About 10 years ago, I was in Denmark and I was on a train and this woman got on the train. She was probably late 60s, maybe early 70s, and she was carrying a really heavy bag. So she got on the train and I got up and I said, oh, do you want me to give you a hand with your bag? Because she was going to put it up above the head things she said no it's okay i will do it if i can't do it now i'm not going to be able to do it later and i was like wow that's a great attitude to have anyway she sat down in front of me um and we got talking and she said that she'd just been to visit some friends and she was heading back home and she was excited to get back home and go for a swim in the sea this was january it was probably minus 20 outside and my mind was blown. I was like, what, you go swimming in in this weather while, it, while it's cold? Is it not cold? Like, do you not get ill? Like, these are all the questions I had. You see, I have always swam in the sea, in rivers, but it's always been when the sun has been shining. And... This train ride 10 years ago has had an impact on me, whether I subconsciously knew it at the time or I'm just realising now by piecing together the last 10 years. But I, I swim in cold water, as you know, on a regular basis, whether it's summer, winter, spring, autumn whether it's icy, whether it's raining, whether it's snowing, whether the sun's shining, I get in the water. 10 years ago, I was sat on a train questioning a woman about getting in cold water when it's cold outside in the winter. And now here I am doing it myself. So the point of this story is you are able to change and new experiences and new learning and new understanding gives you that pathway to start to make the change. It plants a seed and once that seed is planted inside you, it might take 10 years, it might take 20 years, but subconsciously it's in the back of your mind and then you start to seek out things or you notice things more or Things are brought to your attention. You're more aware. And then you start to learn. You start to be curious. You start to experience it. You start to give it a go. And then it becomes just part of who you are. So I guess what I'm saying is be open to new experiences. Be open to what other people have to say. There isn't one way to do things. Like I remember being told as a kid, oh don't go, don't go out like out without a jacket on, it's too cold, you'll get ill. Don't go in the water, it's too cold, you'll get ill. Is that right? To just go with one thing that we're being told? Or is it worth opening your mind a little bit and diving down different avenues to figure out what aligns with you and what doesn't align with you? Because everything that we are is how we have been conditioned. And you have the power and the control to put yourself into new situations that will open your mind and give you an alternative way to do things. It doesn't have to be done the way You've always known it to be done. There are other ways. And I'm talking about swimming as the context, but there are so many, there are so many seeds that have been planted along my journey that are now I'm now connecting the dots with and thinking, ah, okay. I can't believe I used to like like live like that and think that was the only way. Or I can't believe I used to do that and now I do that. And being curious, being open-minded, 
taking on other people's opinions that might not that you might not agree with at the time but then you come around to a deeper understanding you learn more things and then you grow into like a, a newer version of yourself and sometimes that means getting rid of old things sometimes that means introducing new things sometimes that means things stay the same but being open-minded to change is exciting like what what else is possible if i thought while swimming in the winter was mind-blowing like how can you do that and now it's a part of my daily life and i don't even question it what else is possible what else could you add to your life that you didn't think was possible before just wanted to share that quick story with you have a good day See you in the next video.